Let's say I wanted to find the exact value of the integral between 1 and 2 of 17 take away 30x over 5 take away 6x, 2x plus 1. Now, in this section, we've been learning about partial fractions. Partial fractions is the method that I will utilize to help me on my way. OK, because it's the current stance, I cannot do anything with this. If you haven't met integration yet, OK, because of where this is coming in the playlist, uh, you will need to come back to this video later. OK, so once you've gone through all of the second year integration, um, I would suggest you come back and have a look at this video to see how this is done. OK, and how partial fractions is included. So what we're going to do is we are going to break this fraction apart. 5 takes 6x over 2x plus 1. And that's going to be equivalent to a over 5 takes 6x plus b over 2x plus 1. OK. So multiplying up by the two brackets, we'll get a lots of 2x plus 1 and b lots of 5 take 6x. So let's choose some values of x to knock out the brackets. So let's take out this one first. So let x be 5 sixths. So substituting into that, that into the left-hand side first, 17 take away 30 lots of 5 sixths gets me negative 8. And then substituting into here, we've got two lots of 5 sixths plus the 1 uh, gives me 8 thirds, A. So that means that A would have to be minus 3. So now to knock out this bracket, let X be minus a half. So substituting into the left-hand side, 17 take away 30 lots of minus a half is 32. That bracket's gone, so 5 take away 6 lots of minus a half is 8, so 8b. So that means that b would have to be 4. OK. So we can break this apart into uh, a, which is minus 3, so negative 3 over 5 takes 6x and 4 over 2x plus 1. OK. So that's the partial fractions portion out of the way. Now in this format, both of these can be integrated using natural logs. So this one here. Now, the 5 take away 6x, the denominator, differentiates to minus 6. We currently have minus 3 as the coefficient. So we've got a half of what we need. So this should be 1 half the natural log of 5 take away 6x in modular signs. Plus, now the denominator here differentiates to 2. We've got 4 on the top, so we've got twice as much as what we need. So 2 lots the logarithm of uh, mod 2x plus 1. And we're going to evaluate that between 1 and 2. So we've got to substitute the 2 in first. So 1 half log of 5 take away 6 lots of 2. So 5 take 12 is uh, negative 7, modded, so positive 7, plus 2 log 2 lots of 2 plus 1, so 5. Substituting the 1, we're going to get 1 half log of 5 take away 6, so negative 1, modded is 1. Log of 1 is 0, so that's going to be 0 there. Plus 2 log of 3. OK, so um, let's bring this together then, shall we? Right, and so we've got this half here. Um, what I'll do to bring this into one form is bring these powers up. So we've got the half uh, going up to the power of the 7. So log of 7 to the half plus log of 5 squared, so log 25. Remember that's 0. Take away log of 3 squared, so 9. 
Okay. So now I've got 7.5 times 25 divided by 9. So we've got 25 ninths times 7 to the power of a half. Okay. Wondering if I could really write that in a nicer way. Um, I mean, I can't obviously multiply 25 ninths by 7, uh, but um, if we write it like this, um, if we say that's log of, um, really what I'm doing here is, is kind of superficial. Um, just playing around to make it look as nice as possible. Um, if I could bring them on all bits under the half, then I could bring the half out to the front. That'd be useful. So if I do 25 squared, so 625 over 9 squared, 81, times by 7. Now that's all to the half. So I can bring the half out the front of the logarithm. And then I've got the 625 times 7 over 81. So 4375 over 81. OK, right, so let's plug that into the calculator. Let's see what we get. So this is approximately 1.9946. OK. So now if I plug this into my calculator, I can check my result. So 17 take away 30x over 5 take away 6x, uh, 2x plus 1, evaluated between 1 and 2. And we get 1.9946. OK, so very happy that this is correct. OK, so that's how we can incorporate partial fractions into an integration problem.